called me and he said, uh, Mr. Mundo, I, I want you to come to the Chamber of Commerce and tell us why you want to be on the school board. And I thought, there are so many reasons. There are so many reasons that I want to be here. And there are so many reasons in this room today. I look around the room and I see my students that are sitting here that have been so successful that I've watched race uh, Mr. Bogue down the hall uh, and beat him. Yes, uh, I see uh, my colleagues in the back that I grew up with. I see uh, uh, Mrs. Holiday in the back who I loved and I told her, don't burn yourself out because you are a go-getter and you're gonna be successful. I love Hannibal. Uh, I am so proud of the candidates that are here today. You know, I want to say thank you to everybody who cares about our schools and our children. It is the most precious thing in the world to be an administrator, a 28-year veteran of education, and think, what am I going to do when I leave? I went to Christmas vacation. On Christmas vacation, I told my wife, I, said, I don't know if I can leave. I love my schools. I love what I do. My wife had back surgery um, about two weeks ago now, and she's a terrible patient. Uh, <laughs> but uh, I did bring somebody very special to me today. Uh, Debbie Catlin is my plus one, so she's my name today. But, uh, you know, I said, Michelle, I, I, I don't know if, if, if I can leave. And then we had two weeks together, and we were able to take drives, and we were able to reconnect, because right now I work in Lincoln County. I have 28 years of experience, 24 years here in Hannibal, dealing with budgets, dealing with parents, dealing with policy, all of those things, and setting policy for our future. And it was so fantastic when I came back to Lincoln County after my two-week hiatus with my wife the hugs from the kids, and the handshakes from our faculty. You know, those are the things that we think about that can I leave. I have decided to retire in May, um, but I need purpose in my life. And the school board is gonna give me purpose if you elect me. It's gonna stay in education. I'm gonna stay connected to my kids. You know, I never thought I'd be on Facebook. I told my wife, never, never, I'll never have Facebook. She said, Blaine, you won't understand the connections that you'll make with your kids. And it's true. It's the kids like Colin Welch who befriended me on Facebook. And I get to see what's going on in their life. I get to see their kids. It's fabulous, it's fabulous. Uh, now I don't post uh, anything about debates. I won't debate on Facebook. I won't do any of that stuff. But I love keeping up with people. You know, the line that I always use, that I've always said, is be involved with the things that affect your life. What affects our life more than education? What affects our life more than education? Turning out the kids that are going to be our future. That's what we need and we need great people. We have a great school board, we have a great district. I love our district. I love the people that have run our district for years. They've done a fantastic job. Gonna end with the last thought. A little Mark Twain for you. Mark Twain said, always be yourself, unless you can be a pirate, then always be a pirate. <laughs>